Hi ladies, welcome back. And if you are brand new, welcome to the channel. My name is Shelly Pelly. I'm a style, beauty, and wellness influencer. Here, we are much more than a channel. We are a community. This is a respite from the outside world where women can share, connect, and learn to be the very best versions of themselves in a no judgy eyes environment. Join me every Tuesday and Friday for all things style, wellness, and beauty. I would love to have you as part of our community. Most of you saw my last video, five foods that will age you quicker than you can say age. Today, I'm going to outline 15 foods that are anti-aging, beautifying, good for your skin. Certainly, there are more than 15 good foods, but I wanted to share the ones that I particularly like and incorporate regularly into my vegan diet. I've been plant-based vegan for about the past two and a half years, so I do integrate some seafood into my diet a few times a week just for good lean protein. That I have found has helped my skin to remain pretty healthy and vibrant. Um, I'm 54 years old for most of you that don't know. From fighting free radicals to smoothing fine lines, some types of foods are packed with all the good stuff for glowing skin. Aging well isn't about a cream or a serum. The foundation is what you put into your body, eating as close to the source as possible. The foods we choose to put on our body on a consistent basis affect our skin, how we age, how we glow, and of course, how you feel. Here are 15 of the best foods to help keep your skin beautiful, healthy, glowing and aging well. Live your life within the moment, moment number one, fatty fish. We're talking salmon, mackerel, sardines. All of those are very high in omega-3s, which are amazing for your skin. These fatty acids help to keep your skin supple and moisturized, reduce inflammation, and can even help to make your skin less sensitive to the sun's UV rays. Fatty fish like this is also a great source of vitamin E, which is essential for helping to protect your skin from free radicals and environmental damage, both of which accelerate the skin's aging, no bueno. Lastly, these types of fatty fish provide zinc. Zinc is a mineral vital to regulating the following. Inflammation, overall skin health, and the production of new skin cells. Salmon is one of my favorites and it's so easy to make. And because of the fat, it's very, very satiating. Number two, avocados. I love avocados. I don't know who doesn't. These are a great source of vitamin E and also a great source of those omega-3 fatty acids. Vitamin E is an antioxidant that helps protect skin from oxygen oxidative damage. They also contain compounds that are known to help protect your skin from sun damage. One study involving over 700 women found that a high intake of total fat, specifically the types of fats found in healthy options like the avocado and the salmon, was associated with skin that was much more supple and much more springy. I like having avocado just on its own for a snack. I put a little um, Himalayan sea salt and pepper on it and eat maybe half an avocado a day. And again, the fat makes it very satiated. Eating. So I'm not hungry afterwards and I feel good that I know I'm doing something great for my skin. Walnuts and really almost any nut. Another good source of essential fatty acids, which are fats that your body cannot make itself. So we need to help it along with good healthy foods. Still along the nut line, sunflower seeds, excellent source of nutrients, including vitamin E, which is an important antioxidant for the skin. I like sunflowers in my salads. It offers that good little nuttiness, crunchiness. I have maybe a couple tablespoons and of course, you can also do those with the walnuts. It depends on what nut you like better. I like them both, so I will incorporate both of them. Okay, y'all, time for shout outs. This is the time when I can really express how much I appreciate every single one of you. I'd like to give a shout out to my girl, Miss Lynette Mariscal and Miss Girl CL. Ladies, thank you for being a part of the community. I truly appreciate having you here. And if you would like a shout out, subscribe to my channel, comment below. I have brand new videos every Tuesday and Friday, and I would love to have you as part of our community. Next one. And sweet potatoes. I like sweet potatoes. Excellent, excellent source of beta carotene. Beta carotene is a nutrient found in plants that can help keep your skin healthy by acting as a natural sunblock. When consumed, beta carotene, an antioxidant, can help prevent sunburn, cell death, and dry wrinkled skin. Sweet potatoes can make an amazing meal. Side note, for weight management, I really stick to no more than like two carbohydrate servings a day. Your body may work differently. So if I'm going to have a whole 
sweet potato. That is my starchy carb for the day. Do not deep fry them. See my video on things that'll F up your skin. You want to bake them off. Red and yellow bell peppers, of course. Peppers contain plenty of beta carotene and vitamin C. Both of these are super important antioxidants for your skin. Vitamin C is also necessary to create collagen. That's the structural protein that helps to keep our skin looking strong and young-ish. Broccoli, full of tons of vitamins and minerals that are important for skin health, including zinc, vitamin A, and vitamin C. It also contains lutein, which works a lot like a beta carotene. It helps to protect our skin from oxidative damage, which can make it appear dry and wrinkly. Tomatoes, another great source of vitamin C, and all of the other major carotenoids, including lycopene. Beta carotene, lutein, lycopene have all been shown to protect your skin against sun damage and may also help to prevent wrinkling. Tip. Fat increases the absorption of carotenoids. So you'll want to pair carotenoid rich foods like a tomato with a good source of fat, like an olive oil. That's going to help it absorb better into your body. I love in the summertime, I have cherry tomatoes. I toss it with olive oil, fresh sea salt, torn basil, Kalamata olives, and I have it as a snack really, really good. Green tea. I am not much of a tea person, but my husband's English, so he loves this. Powerful compounds found in green tea are called catechins. These work to not only improve the health of your skin, but protect it from damage and aging as well. Like several other antioxidant containing foods, green tea works to protect your skin against sun damage. In one 12 week study involving 60 different women, they found that drinking green tea daily helped to reduce the redness from sun exposure by up to 25%. It also worked to improve the moisture, roughness, thickness, and suppleness of their skin overall. Tip, green tea is great for your skin, but don't have it with milk. Why? Because there's evidence that milk can actually reduce the effect of the green tea's antioxidants. Red grapes, another one that I really love. The skin of red grapes contain a compound called resveratrol. In addition to a wide range of health benefits, this particular compound has been shown to reverse the effects of aging. Test tube studies also suggest that it could help to slow the production of harmful free radicals, which damage skin cells and cause signs of aging. I know what you're thinking. Yes, this compound is found in red wine, but there isn't enough evidence to suggest that the amount that you would get from a glass of wine is really going to have any effect. And of course, red wine is an alcohol. You guys, I don't care how much you justify it. Alcohol sucks for your skin. It just does. Flax seeds. Flax seeds come in tiny brown seeds, or you can get them like I do in the ground format. I add these to a chia seed almond milk mixture that I love to make. Doesn't really taste like much of anything, but I know that I'm getting all of the good fiber. Flax seeds are high in omega-3 fatty acids. They can help to reduce the harmful effects of UV radiation, pollution, the environment, and work toward lessening wrinkles and reducing the dryness of your skin. Also high in omega-3s are chia seeds. Kiwis, I love kiwis. Did you know that kiwis are actually higher in vitamin C than oranges? I didn't know that either. Vitamin C is a powerful, powerful antioxidant that helps to zap free radicals in our skin. Many studies have shown that vitamin C works to protect our skin from sun damage. It helps with the production of collagen and helps to make the skin much more hydrated. Tip, eat kiwis when they're fully ripe as this is when they have the most antioxidants in them. Kale and spinach, honestly, really any dark leafy green, a nutritional powerhouse. It is literally like skin medicine in your refrigerator. You get virtually every vitamin in the book, including tons and tons and tons of skin-friendly antioxidants. I have kale and spinach every flipping day. You guys know that I love my green smoothie that I make every single morning. I'll put the link to the recipe down below. It packs everything that is amazing and good for your skin in one glass. Carrots. Carrots are also high in beta carotene and they're also a really good source of magnesium. Magnesium helps to relax nerves and muscles. If you're not getting enough magnesium diet, that can lead to poor sleep, which as you know, can greatly affect the health and vibrancy of our skin. I mean, when people say beauty sleep, it came from a particular notion. Getting enough sleep, and that means seven to eight hours, is really important to healthy, glowing skin. Sleep is really important. And finally, water. Obviously, it's not a food, but water is really important to your skin as well. This is one of my most 
difficult ones because I don't like water for whatever reason, but it's a really easy way to bump up your skin's glow, especially if you're prone to dry skin. You've probably heard drink eight glasses of water a day. Honestly, there's no hard set rule. And remember that we get a lot of water from our foods too, especially if you're eating a good, healthy plant-based diet. There is a lot of water in your greens, your salads, all of that kind of stuff. Okay, y'all, so those are 15 foods that really help us to age well and age the best that we can. If you have any feedback, I always love hearing from you. And until a couple days from now, I'll see y'all soon. Bye. Live your life within the moment, moment. And don't go wait until the morning.